figure out where the hell I'm going and get there. Uh, let's see, I'm in Syndicate right now, so let's look for some Lusik. Um... Into CF. So let's see. Okay. Oh, we're super close to solitude. Hells to the MF and yeah. So let's go to PR. Look at that. It jumps away. So let's get my GIP tank over to some low sec. Try to find a couple of these um, new pirates. These new rats. And, uh... <laughs> yeah, sorry. Sorry, I get I get excited and I squeak. I do. It's, it's going to happen when we jump through the gate, too. So, yeah, just be aware. And I have my my nice little mug here of uh, courage. Ah, let's see. Let's see if anything is fun. Oh, look, there's Clayton. Sorry, I'm getting PMs from a goon. Uh, from a fellow goon. Let's see here. I also run a meetup, so I'm, uh, and the meetup is tomorrow, but I can't go because I'm doing the SEL. So, bye. -bye. So, he was asking about the meet tomorrow, so I had to give him info. I can show you guys too, if you want to see. Oh, look, here it goes! <laughs> and I like, and it like, takes your stuff down so it's like a nice clean screen. Hmm. It's awesome. So let's see. Uh, Eve maps. I think I want to find a pretty good, like a pretty, oh, I probably shouldn't have gone this way. No, I don't want to go that way. I changed my mind. I changed my mind. I want to go to Komonowet. Because Komonowet, uh, the reason I don't want to is, and I'll show you why, um, so right now, I'm in this system here. If I go to Perineener, or whatever that is, it it continues on into high sec. So we're looking at Eve Maps of Dot Land right now. The red dashes, that's um, low sec. The green circles, the green solids are high sec, and so I need to stop my ship and go to the other gate and clear my waypoint. Sorry. And, um, but if I go to Konament, I can either go up through this low sec pipe or go over into this low sec here, which is probably what I'll end up doing depending on um, the status of the system. I want to try to get into some higher low sec. And I should, instead of looking at NPC kills, let's look at status. So, uh, 
perimeter was the higher sex system. So I want to get into something pretty low. So we are going to go to probably to Velo. Actually, we'll, we'll look in a couple belts in Comet since it's a point three, just to get a feel. Um, what some higher sex systems look like for those for those rats, and and I should probably also look for belts. Look at belts. Okay, so good. So we're going in an area with that are that have a nice surplus of belts. So Comoran is going to have 13 belts, and uh, Yves is going to have 25. And uh, we're in solitude. And this this again is Eve Maps. This is a third party resource, and you get to it by going to evemaps.land.net. And this is run by a player named Wolari. And so I'm just going to start going to belts and uh, seeing where people are. And I'm going to put this down. Or seeing where the rats are, rather. If you have a link, tweet it to me, and I'll link it. And the, um, Thecla knows my knows my Twitter, but there it is. Let's see here. So Serpentis wing leader, not what I'm looking for. So that's one belt. Uh oh. I care about none of those guys. So that's two belts. Screw those guys. one home, but I'm going to multitask. It's three. And while I'm multitasking, Okay, so what? This is the fourth one. So we have a Serpentis clone soldier. Don't target his invulnerable me. Better let me lock him. Own you, son. Okay, I really don't need to be that close to him. And I, actually, what do I need to be? Oh, I'll meet you. Oh, well, I gotta get in close to scoop the freaking tags. Ugh, that kind of sucks. Oops. I don't think my... Oh, good, 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 good. My hotkeys don't work. Or do. I don't know. So I found a uh, so clone soldier recruit, so let me look at the form at the blog post. 
rather. And this isn't bad. I mean, it's a it's a cruiser, and of course my drones are not doing anything because my hotkeys are not set up. Oh, mercy. That's not the hotkey I use. That's the hotkey I use. And that is the hotkey I use. All right. All right, so it's dying a lot better now. And then I also have a new little little site to scan out as soon as we kill the hell out of this dude. I guess I could turn on my propulsion mod. So bad. That's kind of cool. Oh, and the buzzing. That's the irritating buzzing. So. We're going to speed towards the wreck at 8. Nah, 475 kilometers an hour, 400 miles per hour. Not, uh, not super great. Okay, so, and we got one clone soldier tag. And some scrap metals. So, let us go back to this little fungi her. And I should probably, actually, I should probably not be dumb and go to, like, a planet or something. Yeah. It's always good to not be dumb and Eve, because being dumb will get you killed. Because that's how Eve works. And I'm going to move this back over here. So I can watch local. And you'll come to find Rob Zig that flow charts and graphs are and spreadsheets are the bread and butter of Eve. That is that is the life's blood. Okay, you're No, do not warp to that, please. That is not what I meant to click. Thank you. <laughs> Tiny freak out. Tiny freak out. Spaceship, can you not get me killed? Or can you not let me get myself killed? Rather. Because I'm good at that too. So I don't know, Thecla, what do you think? What do you think about the about the probe thing? Because I was, I was kind of explaining that, uh, well, because, you know, EVE is all about real loss. And now, instead of losing your probes when you leave system, you get them back automatically. So, so what do you think about that? the loss of loss. I'm curious. I do it all the time. I, I misclick constantly. And I'm also like a panic clicker too. So I have to be very careful because I'm like, ah, like I'll just start like freaking out and just like pressing buttons. <laughs> and I really cannot do that, Neve. Right? Right? I don't, like, ah, the new probes. I don't, mm, I'm slowly getting used to it, but it's, uh, 
I don't know. But I don't know if it's that, you know, I'm used to doing it my way. I can do it like that my way. And that eventually, once I get used to the new system, I'll be fine. So. Right? And that's, what, like, what is that going to do to the market? Like, you know... Like, there are people who, who have pro-businesses, you know, running sisters of, of Eve missions or whatever. People are never going to lose probes now. So, like, what kind of economic ramification is that going to have? So, is this going to mean that, you know, doing these probing sites is going to become, like, the easy money in Eve? Because, you know, whatever, but whatever. I need to stop saying whatever so much. Oh, and it's a gas site. Oh, well, I guess we can go look at it and see how pretty it is. I don't have any gas stuff. But we'll scan it down, and then we'll go to the next system and see. Right? There's no distance, and there's no timer. Like, where's the timer? Do probes not time out anymore? Is that the thing? now do probes not time out because yeah there's no distance there's no timer like there's so much information missing and i haven't even looked at, dis at their directional scanner i don't think they changed anything though yeah they didn't change anything with that so let's go look at the gas i will press the pretty little button Yeah, I'm I'm kind of the lazy part of me likes the launching of seven probes at month at, at once because I'm lazy. But when it comes to PVE ramifications, the combat scanning, I don't know I don't know if that's a good thing. Like should combat scanners be faster? And like the sliding scale for um That for ease of probing has happened a lot now it like probing has gone down like way downhill well not probing has become increasingly easier every time they iterate on it maybe that's kind of an unnecessary because it's hard for people to break into the pve aspect but once you break into it like you can get really good at it and i don't know maybe that will create more pvp opportunities I don't know. I have no idea. Oops, I called my voicemail. So, let's see here. So that is the research ruin. So they put new uh, them thematic stuff in there and then those are the gas clouds. But we're not gonna mess with those because I don't have a gas harvester. Uh, let's see here. We're going to go to a different system. So that, so on, on our fourth attempt, we got, um, one of the new, one of the new ships. So, and that was in a what point, this is a point three system. So we're going to go to a point one system and see what we get in there and see how quickly we come across one. Maybe... Oh, uh, I guess this is not really a good pull, but let's see. Sorry, I'm switching my, uh, I want to find a security. Actually, you know what? Why don't I use the in-game browser? Because that's what it's there for. And then if I use the in-game browser, you guys can see what I'm browsing. Doesn't that make sense? That make, that totally makes sense, right? Oh, that's right, because you can't use the in-game browser in Sissy. That's right. I knew that. Okay. So now I don't feel like... Okay. Now I feel kind of dumb. But whatever. Oh, well. I'm a dippy doodle. I'm so. I'm sure mo most of you kind of figure that by now. I'm kind of a ditz. And I do want to find one of those archaeology sites to kind of poke at with my gip tank. 
But hopefully I'll be able to kill off everything quick enough with my three uh, ballistics controls. And my six turrets. Or my six uh, missile launchers. I could have seven, but gotta have the festival launcher. Gotta, you know, gotta have the festival launcher. It's so important. It's an important accessory to any. Locates or us. Apparently there is a channel, uh, Locates R Us, Locates R Us, and um, you can go pay for locator services and even online. There's all kind of fun stuff everywhere. That's what I love about this game. Like, you can just find anything, anywhere, it's whatever. Yeah, that that is um Biffbox brings up a pretty good point with the with probing. When you're a newer player, you have to, you're in and out of ships. But that's kind of let's see if you know, when you when you grow up, when you get bigger, you'll be able to to fly the tangus that, you know, the big kids fly. And uh I just need to train for a tangu. It would take me eight days to get into a Tengu, and I just, I won't, I won't train for a Tengu. I am so scared. Wait, didn't they take away losing skill points? I think they took away losing skill points. And so why am I not in the Tengu? Maybe I'm protesting the taking away of skill points. <laughs> yes, and you know what? Um, go to the feedback thread. In fact, let me post that because with the probing, uh, with the new probing, that's the probing feedback thread. So I just posted the posting feedback thread in the um, in the in the channel. So if you have any feedback. Do put that in there. Make sure that you are being productive with your feedback. So, and when I say productive, you know, I'm saying we when you post, say, you know, I believe you should change this. You change. You should change X because of Y and A, B, and C. Back me up in this. So, so make sure you're stating, you know, good solid arguments and stuff like that. Um, and make sure that you're keeping Eve in mind, because even Eve, you know, they want to do a little time-based training. They want to do, and and there's this thing about time-based training is going, um, double account training is going to be available for. Ooh, there's somebody in here. And they're in a hawk. Huh. I could probably take them. <laughs> yeah, I went there. You know what? Come on, let's do it. Let's play. Come on, son. Let's get out of here. I'm feeling feisty. I'm feeling frisky. Oh, yes. And um, Rob Zig, you are a new player. Um, take a look at the post on the forums. And when I say uh, take a look at the post, take a look at the whole post. Because if you look at the full post, and I'll, I'll post the full post, there are a bunch of helpful Eve links on there. So, um... I reposted so you can see the full post. So things like Evegate, um, Aura, which is the Android app. If you have an Android phone app, in fact, here's my Android phone. And I'm going to make sure. See my Android phone app? Or my Android phone. And right there on the front of my Android phone, right 
there you can see my aura app you see my aura app because because I love aura she reminds me when I'm a bad and have not updated any of my crap any of my my two characters so um, also good things for new players Evemon that that's an out of game uh, skill tracker e EFT that will help you build fits for your ships or Pypha or EVHQ um, organizations for new players oh and I you know what I haven't put the angel project on there either that is baddie nope that is not the angel project I'm looking for So, oh, that's cool. That's like you know he lives in Austin. I see him all the time. He comes to the eve meets and stuff. He's is Jason not a mess? Oh my goodness, he's crazy. Did you? I'm sure you got an earful of his trolling. He's he's a nutbag. Oh, well, you don't have to use your cell phone. It's <laughs> but there but there are a lot of good stuff. Um check out check out the Angel Project. Um she that's run by Sindel and she gives out a lot of free shit. Um training organizations that help all new players, um, Eve University, uh Red versus Blue. If you want to learn how to PvP, Red versus Blue is a great place to just jump in and get your feet wet. Thecla uh is with Red versus blue. Um, Brave newbies, uh, they do more null sex stuff, and then of course there's um, collections of podcasts and blogs as well. So, and I'll I'll have to get one full of for the streamers. So let's see once you. So we're already at our third bell, and we haven't had one of the clone guys pop up yet. I'm not sure what our hawk friend is doing. Maybe he's just chilling like a villain. Sissy testing in progress. What is that? It's a control tower. Hmm. Troll face Ibris. Sissy testing. There's our hawk friend. I should kill him out. Damn it. <laughs> That's what I get for not having anything on my ship. <laughs> oh well. I shouldn't pick on players. <laughs> I should pick on people. <laughs> And hawks. I'm a baddie. <laughs> I know how to directional scan. I'm just super lazy. I'm just really super lazy. I can actually directionally scan fairly well. I just wasn't concerned because he was a hawk and I was like, oh, well, if I was to come across him, I'll just kill him. Because it's a hawk, what is he going to do? Damn it. I think he's pretty much cleaned out this whole thing. I probably need to stop cursing on this stream, too. So let's go to Fur Willy. What's that? F A U R. Because I really want to try it in a point one system. <laughs> Is that the one I want to go to?
<laughs> you know you gotta fuck with people. <laughs> you know you just gotta mess with people. Let me ask him. I wonder what his, what his success rate has been like with finding the new rats. So I just asked him that, and we'll see. Let's stop messing with people. That's true, the hawk could own me if like the right person was in it. Especially since I'm really bad and I'm poorly fit. Oh damn it. I totally just did not shit. Oh. Okay, so go with a system with a lot more belts. Alright, so yeah, we'll go to this other system. Um, let me see. I was gonna go to Furley. Let me see how many belts. There's twelve belts in the system we're gonna go to. So, I guess I could do this. Orbital bodies. So, you can see orbital bodies here. And the asteroid belts. The asteroid belt, one, two, etc. Let's see. That's the sovereignty. That really doesn't a whole hell of a lot. But yeah, we're going to go four jumps away to another point one system that has way more belts than the one we're in right now. Uh, you know what? We may go to here, which is a 2.1. Oh, well, that's on the way. We know what we're going to stop at here, which is a point two. So, we'll see. We shall see. Has anybody seen the new Iron Man movie? I'm just curious. Iron Man. Yay, nay, kinda. Yes, no. Maybe. I heard it was really good. My cousin said it was good. I trust his judgment. He's a bit of a nerd. He comes from, from good nerd stock. Would have seen my previously. <gasps> that would that would, yeah yeah. I know I don't try. I don't travel with my directional scanner open, but yeah. I know a lot of people like the good PVPers <laughs> keep their directional scan open <laughs> while they're looking for stuff. So there is that. I'm gonna try to. Fine. 